Hijab is so beautiful, but I just don't know if I'm ready yet. <sighs> Seems like my parents have already made up their mind about that. Oh, another just asked question. I'm not ready to wear a hijab, and my parents keep telling me to. How can I convince them that I'm not ready? Oh, salam alaikum. I'm from My Voice Canada, a youth magazine for the youth and by the youth. And you're watching our Just Ask series, Daily This Ramadan. Where you ask and we answer. So tune in on Iyawaz to watch us live or on our YouTube channel, My Voice Canada. So I was flipping through this issue of My Voice magazine, and I think I found the answer to your question. No one likes being forced to do anything. But what if you weren't ready to pray? Would you say you just don't want to? When we know something is a command of Allah's, then we don't really go into our feelings and our logic. To be a Muslim means to submit. And submission means to not argue and dilly-dally, but really to say, if it's from Allah, I will do it. Hijab in Surah Nur is for a woman to be modest enough to lower her gaze. Mind you, that starts with men. It then goes on to say that the scarf she is wearing should come and cover her chest. Because in those days, even non-believers used to cover their hair. Then, Allah says that a woman should not beautify herself on top of what she is already given and to hide her adornments, like jewelry. And to not stomp their feet so they don't get noticed. Logic would say that things that make noise like anklets and tapping of the heels, etc. All these things that draw attention. Now, imagine if wearing the scarf was unimportant. Would you just simply take it off while praying? So I totally get it when you say you're not ready. I mean, most girls would love to walk around with their hair out and not cover up, but we do so to obey Allah. So I suggest that you make a connection with him whatever way you can about the hijab, the meaning of which, which is barrier so that that can act as a barrier against the many temptations out there.